in today's video we are doing watercolor on canvas so first of all we will be preparing our canvas for watercolor i have already done two to three coats of gesso white gesso on my canvas now i am using the watercolor ground medium there are many brands that make it but the i got this one from try art from desserts you can also get one from golden i will link it down in the description box below so i have taken that watercolor ground medium and i have added enough liquid and made a liquidy mixture of it and now i will apply two coats of this watercolor ground medium on my canvas evenly and nicely i will cover it and let my canvas dry for 24 hours so that the ground watercolor ground medium settle down completely on my canvas now after 24 hours i already did the two coats of those now i have taken a sand paper and i'm lightly sanding it out because since that medium has little bit of roughness in it so i just wanted to sand it out a little bit to give my canvas a smooth look so now our canvas is prepared for watercolor and i'm taking my watercolor by van gogh and the water and my watercolor round brush so the colors that i have taken are one is on one canvas i'm doing light gray with a hint of metallic silver and on the other one i'll be doing the very light pastel shade of pink pinkish red and then on top of that i'll be doing the calligraphy so with the watercolor medium what happens it let your canvas water water spread evenly on your canvas and the canvas like the canvas cloth with which the canvas is make made up of doesn't absorb water and let the you work freely with the watercolors because as we know watercolor needs lots of water to work with and to get this splash effect we really need good amount of water on a can on our canvas without the watercolor medium my canvas would have absorbed all of this water and my this effect would not have come out like how it had it is coming out right now so this is my first time doing watercolor on canvas i had also not done this ever before i i am doing this on watercolor paper from a long time but with canvas i was very new and i was scared also but my client want, wanted watercolor on canvas because she loved the splash effect with the light color and she really wanted to get it done on a canvas so i just went ahead did some research and got this crown medium and i'm really happy how this turned out so this watercolor effect took some time like i let the canvas dry for 12 hours i did it in the evening and let it dry whole night and then next day i did the calligraphy on this so up till that time the watercolor background was completely dry and my calligraphy came out very nice so the pen that i'm using for calligraphy is the oil based marker paint pen by sharpie so it is one of the most amazing effects that uh, you can create on water uh, on canvas with a watercolor but i'm really not very much in favor of con creating this again because i'm not sure about its durability like how long this will be durable because on watercolor canvas you cannot do the varnish because it will again activate your watercolor so this is how my gallery wall turned out this is the pink one the pastel that i was talking about i didn't record this one and this is our gray one so it they my client wanted to create a gallery wall with this so this is how it turned out and we did some neutral abstract kind of look with a pink and gray which is in her room <clears throat> so we are really we were really excited she also loved it so i hope you guys like my video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give it a big thumbs up thank you so much for watching